for lab 27, the question asks us what happens when the JavaScript on submit event is deleted. And it's talking about the lab where we change the security level from zero to one, which enables the JavaScript validation and blocks some types of input. We'll start off in level zero just to illustrate. So let's say that we have a cross-site scripting proof of concept. So we're just testing the page and we send that in and it works. We toggle the security to security level one. We try to enter the same proof of concept, but it gets cut short because there's some HTML validation. We can right click and inspect element and remove that because that's just a client side control. So we see the max length is 20. Delete that setting. Then we're able to paste the entire script. But we submit the request and we see that there's some kind of JavaScript validation. And again, that's a client side control, so it's very easy to disable that. And it goes to show uh, security controls have to be on the server side. So we found the on submit event. We delete that event. Now the on submit event won't fire, so the JavaScript validation will never be called. And there won't be an error message. So by deleting the on submit event, what happens is, is the JavaScript form validation is immediately disabled because without the event, it's never going to be called and it's never actually going to check the input. We click on the third option, submit, and find that's the correct answer.